You are listening to Utah Public Radio. I'm Shalane Smith-Needham. It's time for our weekly movie review with our film critic, Casey T. Allen. Great to have you back in studio with us. Here I am. And you watched the newest thriller out by M. Night Shyamalan, Old, not scoring too high with film critics. Can't wait to hear your review, Casey. After the goofily far-fetched films Split from 2016 and Glass from 2019, director M. Night Shyamalan has not received much critical praise the past few years. Old is Shyamalan's latest film, and it's thankfully not a schizophrenic disaster, but it's not a brilliant triumph either. While on vacation at a tropical island, a family is taken to a mysterious beach that causes people to age rapidly. Trapped in a false paradise, the confused tourists try to figure out an escape before time runs out. Old tries to be a Christopher Nolan-esque psychological thriller meets Agatha Christie mystery, addressing the universal fears of mortality and loss. Loss of youth, loss of loved ones, and loss of memory. I think most viewers will agree with me that M. Night Shyamalan's greatest strength is not believable screenwriting. So often his films tread a fine line between interesting and stupid, and old is no exception. It has moments of intrigue through its evasive cinematography and unsettling musical score, but it also goes over the top with stereotypical characters and a laughably excessive death scene. Some of the dialogue is written with a realistic maturity, and some of it feels stunted or awkward, as if the actors themselves are unsure about what emotional direction to take. Old is not the movie of the summer, and it certainly doesn't achieve the focused innovation or newness of Shyamalan's earlier films like The Sixth Sense or The Village, but at least it's not as bad as Lady in the Water or After Earth. Since everyone has their own personal anxieties about death and growing old, maybe the director's real intention was to ignite the varied and nuanced reactions from viewers like myself. Well, Casey, do you recommend we still go out and see this film? I don't know. I I thought it was okay. It's hard when I land somewhere in the gray area to spur people out of their homes when it's only okay. It's really up to you listening at home or in your car. Well, are we seeing any other summer blockbuster movies out? Sometimes it seems by August uh, we are starting to move more into the fall movie season. What can we look forward to? It is going to start to taper off, but not before Disney brings us back to theme park nostalgia with Jungle Cruise, premiering this coming weekend. All right. Thanks for being here, Casey, and we'll see you back here next week. My pleasure. I have a question.